So PathLab is an online resource. It is free of charge. It was made to help students learn pathology in their own time and space. So the two main components are the Virtual Pathology Museum, which houses uh, more than 700 digitized pathology specimens, like those you see behind me. It's just in digital format and with labels. And it also houses the other main section, which is Pathology Demystified. And that is kind of like a self-directed learning tool where students can look at videos, they can uh, do interactive quizzes and things like that. We started it in the third quarter of 2017. And in terms of growth, we did open it up to registration anywhere, so users could use it from overseas as well. And we first started off with about 120 uh, users from about 10 countries. Um, and then now, about four years later, we have about 3,000 users uh, from more than 120 countries. What I conceptualized was the interactive cases, which I thought was a nice feature to help students apply the things they've learned in pathology in a real-life clinical scenario. So another idea that came to me from this was to add the normal histology section to the website so that students would have a readily available reference of what normal looks like so that when they look at the things that are normal, it's a direct comparison and you can see immediately what's normal and what's not. So the advantage of having PathWeb was that we could access it anytime that we wanted and that helped me to catch up on some of the content that I was not able to um, immediately absorb. There was more context to what we learned in class. So being able to have the 3D impression of the pod of what we learned was very helpful in making the experience a lot more engaging as well as vivid. And I think that personally helped making studying pathology more fun and engaging for myself. So one very, very uh, significant thought that I can remember is um, the one about uh, FAP. And um, honestly, having Pathware really helped, you know, sear that into my memory. And uh, honestly, it made uh, studying uh, pathology a lot easier because uh, I can just remember that hair raising uh, picture, uh, which brings back, you know, all the alleles and the genes involved and, and how it becomes like cancer. I'm the main uh, point person in terms of the Instagram posts and the interactions with the students. Sometimes also there can be uh, some questions, for example, Insta story quizzes. And if they have any doubts, they can also uh, directly message me and then I'll, I'll respond on, on the PathWeb social media app. So, so it's a very interactive uh, experience. In fact, there have been uh, some students who are so uh, uh, interested in PathWeb Instagram that they also uh, contribute content which I shared with, uh, on, on this platform. So the posts are, are usually put up with a short uh, clinical stem. So there's a mixture of text and as well as pictures. Considering the fact that pathology education is very much image uh, dependent and, and Instagram is uh, very well adapted to putting up pictures, so it all complements very nicely.